what I've been doing, and I wonder if other historians have loved response papers as much as I am, that kind of weekly low stakes writing assignment that students would do after they'd done the reading, but before they'd come to class. And for me, the annotation got the best elements of those response papers in that it asked students to read at a deeper level. It allowed them to practice low stakes writing. But then it had some other aspects of response papers that it was different and better in some ways. So for example, I am kind of frustrated when I am the only audience for students' response papers. So this allowed them to practice writing to an audience of their peers. I found it to be hugely motivating for students who would want to see how other students had reacted. Um, I thought that it was kind of, it allowed them to process some of the information of reading through conversation. And then also the way that they could make it more multimedia. So the fact that I was getting YouTube links, YouTube videos, Wikipedia links, pictures in the margins, just allowed students to kind of bring that material to life in ways that they were not always, I think, feeling welcome to do in response papers.